All right, hey, let's welcome back. How's everyone doing? Uh, previously, I believe we were just getting some hawk feathers, and we grabbed. We tried to find Jar Germain, but we weren't lucky in doing so because he was supposed to be at the uh, Bard's College, right over here, and he ended up not being there. So yeah, I think I think it's right over here. Isn't it? Oh wait, no, I, I'm turned around. It's right here. But yeah, anyways, um, we picked up a couple of side quests as well, which is nice. Um, I'm going to go ahead and head off to the College of Winterhold, though, because that is where I was planning on going in the first place. Uh, I think we're pretty good on all the stuff that we have in our inventory. We can kind of get rid of it if we need to, but yeah. Um, let us really quickly go to the College of Winterhold. And do forgive me a little bit, I used to have, do have a bit of a stuffy nose still, and I'm working on trying to get that out of the way, but that is why I sound a little bit different, or congested, or if I go, like, a bunch, that is why. So I'll try to mute if I can, but, um, I have no promises, right? Uh, anyways, services. let's talk to Mirabelle. Welcome to the college. You said something about a tour? Yes, just a brief overview of our facilities. Are you ready? I'd love to have a look around. Wonderful. Please follow me and don't wander off. Sounds good. The of Winterhold has been a fixture in Skyrim for thousands of years. The Divine prominent smile feature here is the Hall of the Elements. It's our primary location for lectures, practice sessions, and general meetings. The Arcanium is located above the Hall, and the Archmage's quarters above that. While technically in charge of the College, the Archmage's responsibilities often keep him occupied. Thus, I run the day-to-day -day operations. Now, I if you'll please many follow me, I'll show you the living quarters. Your concerns Unfortunately, are not we've had to implement more stringent entry procedures due to some problems with the local Nords. We don't anticipate any real violence, but it never hurts to be prepared. Indeed, for sure. All right, well, let's follow her. Look at us, we're looking pretty snazzy, not gonna lie. Oh, yeah. Alright, so she's just giving us a quick tour of the college, but yeah, we're going to start the College of Winter Old Quest, is like I was saying, and uh, yeah, hopefully we can go ahead and straight through the quest and just finish it, uh, but we'll see. I think we should be able to do that, no problem, honestly, so that should be fine. But yeah, let's do it, let's do it. Our newest members are housed here, in the Hall of Attainment. I'll ask that you please keep your voice down while inside as others may be working on research, or delicate experiments. Alright. Let's head inside then. Hall of Attainment. Let's do it. Now I'll show you to your quarters. You're going to be sharing space with your fellow apprentices, who you'll meet shortly. This is where you'll be staying. This bed and desk are yours. Please try and be considerate of others. Now, let's go back to the Hall of the Elements, where most of the members gather for lectures and study sessions. Okay, let me just loot everything in here real quick, since it is mine. <laughs> Definitely go ahead and sell all this stuff. I <laughs> uh, got some mead in there. What else we got? Wardrobe. More stuff we can sell. I should uh, sleep. I finished showing you the we can talk. Yeah, definitely. I should sleep, but I don't want her running off on me accidentally. I think I don't think she will, but just in case, I'll, I'll wait on it just to, just to be safe. All right, let's head back out. I think she said we'll go into the Hall of the Elements or something. Initially, you'll be learning from Tolfdir, one of our most esteemed wizards. All right. <clears throat> Excuse me. Wolf deer, huh? He's a good fella, I think. Look at this place, though. Pretty cool, huh? Good old College of Winterhold. Wolf deer is likely already addressing the new apprentices. Go on in. And if you have any problems, let one of our senior members know. Alright, will do. Thank you. Alright, let's listen to Tolfter. Open Hall of the Elements. I think it's just right in here. So the gates. Yeah. Welcome 
Welcome. We were just beginning. Please, stay and listen. So, as I was saying, the first thing to understand is that magic is, by its very nature, volatile and dangerous. Unless you can control it, it can and will destroy you. Sir, I think we all understand that fairly well. We wouldn't be here if we couldn't control magic. Of course, my dear, of course. You all certainly possess some inherent natural ability. That much is not being questioned. What I'm talking about is true control. Mastery of magic. It takes years, if not decades, of practice and study. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get started. Please, please. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Eagerness must be tempered with caution, or else disaster is inevitable. Whoops. But we've only just arrived here. You've no idea what any of us are capable of. Why not? Oh, sorry, one second. I gotta get, get this out of the way. Oh, there we go. We're good. A chance to show you what we can do. You've been quiet so far. What do you think we should do? Um. Uh, safety should be more important than anything. Yes. Uh, most, more for the most part. I think we should learn something practical, though. Is that so? See, he agrees with us too. Why don't you actually show us something? All right, let's settle down. I suppose we can try something practical. In continuing with our theme of safety, we'll start with wards. Wards are protective spells that block magic. I'll teach you all a ward, and we'll see if you can successfully use it to block spells, all right? All right. Would you mind helping me with the demonstration? Are you at all familiar with ward spells? Uh, I don't remember. I don't know any ward spells, I guess. That's all right. I can teach you a very basic ward. One that's enough for the purposes of this lesson. <clears throat> okay. Now, if you just Lesser stand right over there, I'll cast a spell at you, and you block it with the ward. Here we go. Over there, please, just opposite me. Wouldn't want anyone else in the way. All right. Uh, let me equip this ward real fast. It is in restoration, of course. Now, Let's get Lydia to walk backwards a little bit, up. buddy. What's the hurry? Go. Thank you. All right, here we go. You have to keep your ward up, or else this won't work. I don't want to hurt you. Over there, please. Just opposite me. Wouldn't want anyone else in the way. Hold still. Excellent work. Nice. Resisted well, it. I think this is an excellent start. I'd like you all to continue practicing with wards, please. I think perhaps we're ready to begin exploring some of the various applications of magic throughout history. The Indeed. college has undertaken a fascinating excavation in the ruins of Sarthor nearby. It's an excellent learning opportunity. I suggest we meet there in a few hours and see what awaits us inside. That's all for now. Thank you. All right. And then everyone's going to head over there. Um, we could talk to all these people, but I think we'll just uh, talk to them a little bit later, probably. Um... Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe maybe we'll try talking to him now. But let's go ahead and get a thing like a destruction or something in our hands. Flames, that wouldn't be bad, actually. Um, frostbite, ice spike, ice spike, I mean. Lightning bolt, sparks. <laughs> this will do flame. Maybe it'll fire bolt. Nah, let's just do flames for now, I guess. That'll be fine. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, let's talk to. You know, this is one of a very few places where you can receive a real education in the schools of magic. Yeah, talk to. Before Bilbo you now. even ask, yes, I have an ancestry steeped in magic, and no, I don't want to talk about it. Yes, I know Winterhold used to be full of my kind, and no, I don't care that they're all gone now. Does that cover everything? Um. We haven't really been introduced. No, I suppose we haven't. Brelina Marion of House Telvani. First of my family to leave Morrowind in a long time. Marion. Now I'm here to study conjuration. That's what's important. Uh, do you know anything about Sarfal? Sarthal? Not really. Just that it's very, very old. It was one of the first cities of men in Tamriel, I think. Alright, uh, do you like it here at the college? So far, 
If only because no one is telling me how great I ought to be. I just want to learn. I don't want to think about what's expected of me. Uh, Winterhold used to be full of dark elves. Didn't you know? Before the Oblivion Crisis, many elves called Winterhold their home. More visited the college from Morrowind every year. After, growing distrust of magic made life difficult for many. Some left rather than endure the growing hatred from the local Nords. Others returned home after the Red Year, when Vardenfell erupted and caused much destruction. Winterhold itself died in the years between then and now. What's left out there is a husk. Only the college really remains. Alright. <clears throat> um, what do you know about Ancano? I know I don't like the way he looks at me. I can't tell if he expects me to blow myself up or to try and murder him. But he clearly doesn't trust any of us. Yeah, fair enough. I'd better get going. All right. Um... College is a bit of an oddity in Skyrim. Magic isn't something that's looked upon fondly here. Fair enough. Uh, let's go ahead and talk to Chisaga real quick. You are new, yes? Have you mastered the expert level destruction spells yet? Uh, not yet, but I will. Ah, this is good. But Chisago will know them first. It is good we'll to finally be around mages who may be able to keep up with Gizargo. Keep up and surpass, you mean? <laughs> uh, yeah, not that everything is a competition. Um, let's see. Why did you become a student at the college? Mages in Cyrodiil are all about politics. The Synod in the College of Whispers are too busy guarding secrets to bother to teach. Skyrim was not Gizargo's first choice. But Winterhold is removed from politics, dedicated to study. This is the place for Chisargo to become great. Fair enough. Uh, you seem excited to be here. Oh yes, Chisargo hopes to find things that will make him a more powerful mage here. Hopefully small things that fit inside pockets and will not be noticed if they are missing. Oh. <laughs> Hello. Um... Not everything is a competition, you know. Oh, but you are wrong. The only reason you could disagree is because you are losing so badly you cannot see it. <laughs> Ironic. Uh, you seem very sure of yourself. There is much for Gizargo to be sure of. There is skill in magic, there is charm, and there is a strong will. Gizargo will be successful. Of this there is no doubt. Alright. Alright then. New here too, eh? I'd hoped I wouldn't be the only Nord, but I should have known better. Uh, why aren't there many Nords at the college? Magic is shunned by most. If it can't be swung over your head and used to crack skulls, most Nords want nothing to do with it. Magic is seen as something for elves and weaker races. No offense, of course. Well, look at the evidence. Nords generally don't trust magic, so it's not off to a good start. Throw in the Oblivion Crisis, which was caused by magic users, and the troubles now with the Old Mary Dominion, who are elves and magic users. And finally, take the fact that the college is the only thing left standing after most of Winterhold was destroyed. It's all fairly damning. Is it difficult being away from your family? Not at all. I consider it a blessing. My family was convinced coming here was a death sentence. Or worse, it took years of insisting that this is what I'm meant to do. Alright, uh, what do you know about Ancana? I know he's from the Thalmor, and that he claims to be here simply as an advisor. I also know that no one really believes that. I've been trying to avoid him, honestly. Well, that's also fair. All right, good talking to you. All right then. Let's move on. Uh, so it says we'll. Skyrim we're... could not be more different from elsewhere, but magic, magic is the same no matter where you go. <laughs> uh, all right. I guess let's go ahead and talk to Ancana. Another new apprentice, I see. Are you of the sort that believe you're here to change the world? Or are you only in it for yourself? I assure you that I shall be watching you, all of you, very closely. Right back at you, buddy. Um, <clears throat> what is it you do here? I am an advisor to the Archmage. The Thalmor wish to promote relations with your college. I am at the Archmage's disposal if he requires advice. Does the Archmage often ask for advice? Perhaps not as often as he should. 
In time, I believe he will be more trusting. Uh, I'd like to know more about the Thalmor. Now that stability has been established between the Dominion and the Empire, we seek only to help Skyrim. To guide its people through this time of transition. To help lead them to a better future. Okay. See you later. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead to meet Sar sorry, meet Tolfdir outside Sarthal, which is going to be our first um, little little thing. Uh, we could actually talk to everyone about the missions as we go through them, but I think we'll probably just skip that for now. Um, if you guys want to see that, maybe maybe we'll do it. We'll see. But yeah, uh, Sarthal isn't too far away actually. It's just right here. Uh, and we have discovered, I believe, everything between here and Sully Hill, if my memory serves. So I'm going to go ahead and fast travel to it just to save a little bit of time. Um, but yeah, usually I, I will try to not fast travel as much. Hello? Who are you? Assassin. Hello, Glass Dagger. Ooh, nice. Dark Brotherhood Assassin's Note. Okay. Why are we? Ooh, wow. Paralyzation potion. Um, why are we getting assassinated? Huh? Let's see. Uh, as instructed, you are to eliminate Trakaro Bone Break by any means necessary. The Black Sacrament has been performed. Somebody wants this poor fool dead. We've already see received payment for the contract. Failure is not an option. Astrid. Okay. So Astrid from the Dark Brotherhood is uh after us it looks like quest items gonna be removed from your inventory okay let's continue on then uh this is sarthal though nice little place kind of a very old place actually let's go ahead and sleep so we can get our rested bonus real fast and then we'll continue on nice some loot here we'll go ahead and grab always useful salt piles yeah i'll take that ingredients are always helpful as well Got a bit of a chest here. Nice. What we got in here? If it's just food, I'm not taking it, but if it's uh, ingredients, I'll take them. That's what I'm searching for. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. I just took some cabbage. <laughs> we'll go ahead and eat it just for fun. Uh, Alright, let's head down. I think the way down is right over here somewhere. There it is. From up there. I guess let's go ahead and... They're up down there, I think. Let's go ahead and uh, check out what's up here up top just real fast lots of snow covered stuff for sure uh, broken urn not a whole lot up here actually but worth a check just in case all right well anyways um, this is a cool looking place isn't it what if there's anything on top of it shall we find out I think I'll wrap up this episode before we head inside Sarthal and then we'll go ahead and do the Sarthal mission in the next part. Seems like a good idea. Nope, nothing on top of here. Well, worth a check. Uh, let's head on down then. The little tiny bit of damage we took from falling there. <laughs> it's okay though. Uh, another little table here. Got some more. Another barrel, little table there as well. But what's this? Silver? Heck yeah, I'll mine silver. Actually, hold on. I forget that uh, you can actually use this pickaxe, right, to hit it? Pretty sure. Heck yeah, dude. That's what I'm talking about. Sweet. <laughs> that's, that's cool. I never actually knew that you could do that, so I, I like that a lot, actually. Alright, well, they're here. This is exciting, isn't it? Yeah, are you nervous about being here? Why? Because it's old and full of dead things? Clearly, you've never spent any time in Morrowind. <coughs> Ding. Roasted. I'd better get going. Uh, the other two aren't here yet, but I think they'll they'll catch up to us. Um, either way, I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here. Thank you guys for watching. I really do appreciate it. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Alright, peace.